A former Roanoke City Councilman will spend two and a half years in prison for embezzlement and other money charges. 10 News reporter Sydney Jacksheimer shares how Robert Jeffrey Jr.'s defense attorney has since responded to the sentence. I sentence Mr. Jeffrey to eight years suspended after active time of two years and six months. Former Councilman Robert Jeffrey Jr. will be behind bars for at least the next two years. This is for the three felony charges he was found guilty of in March. One count of embezzlement and two counts of obtaining money under false pretenses. He has um, frankly created messes, legal and otherwise, for which he, insofar as the court is concerned, has accepted absolutely no responsibility. Just a few minutes after Jeffrey heard his fate, his defense attorney Melvin Hill filed an appeal and requested Jeffrey to be let out on bond. Uh, before we did that, me, uh, filing a notice of appeal, and I told my client last week, it's my view based on what has happened thus far, uh, the judge revoking his bond, the Commonwealth objecting to him being admitted to bail, that he would be receiving an active period of incarceration. Judge David Carson denied the bond request, which is what Assistant Commonwealth Attorney Sherry Mason asked for. Our view is that he's a financial predator. If he is out, if he finds um, a weak individual or some hole that he can wiggle through, he's going to take people's money. Jeffrey was also sentenced to pay $215,000 in restitution. In Roanoke, Sydney Jacksheimer, 10 News, working for you.